The 2025 Polestar 4 is so quick it doesn't even have a rear window. The all-new Polestar 4 offers sporty coupe-like design with the performance to match its hot looks. The Polestar brand is young enough to be in a unique position to really do something different, and it's led by a former Volvo designer, so the results should be interesting. The Swedish automaker has taken that chance and opportunity to do something unique and now delivered the sporty 2025 Polestar 4 all-electric SUV a coupe-like crossover with no rear window that boasts the greatest performance of any Polestar yet. The Polestar 4 is a compact model positioned between the two sedan and recently revealed, slightly larger 3 SUV. Instead of being a bloated 2 or chopped up 3, Polestar promises the 4 is its own thing built on parent company Geely Holdings Sustainable Experience Architecture, C, platform. Taking design cues from the bigger upcoming Polestar 5 flagship sedan, the 4 drops its rear window completely, splits its hammer headlights, and features retractable door handles, flush glazing on the side windows, and aerodynamic blades around the rear light bar for a swift surface. It rides on an 118-inch wheelbase with an overall length of 190 inches, a width of 84 inches, and it's 60.7 inches tall. We may have glossed over it already, but you did read that correctly. The Polestar 4 will not come with a rear window. Instead, the standard panoramic glass sunroof stretches further back into the rear to keep it fresh and offer more light for rear passengers and a roof-mounted exterior camera displays what's behind the car on the interior rear-view mirror screen. The roof is available with optional electrochromic shading, and the mirror can flick back to being just a standard reflective mirror despite no window in case the driver needs to check on rear occupants. The 4 isn't the first production car to ever ditch its rear window, but it'll likely become the highest volume seller to do it. Up front is Polestar's familiar Android Auto OS-powered 15.4-inch landscape touchscreen with built-in Google Assistant, Maps, and Play applications, with over-the-air update capability. There's a 12-speaker Harman Kardon audio setup, or 16 speakers total if you get the available Napa pack with headrest speakers. Rear occupants also get reclining seats, adjustable ambient lighting inspired by the solar system, and a secondary media and climate screen for rear occupant control. The interior overall is said to be inspired by sportswear and soft tech, with a new mist interior color available. Polestar says it took a mono-material approach, with layered components made of the same material for easier future recycling. There's a made-to-fit, 100% recycled polyester knit textile that produces no offcuts or waste, microtech vinyl and Napa leather that's animal welfare secured. 12 cameras, 12 ultrasonic sensors, and one radar make up the Supervision Advanced Driver Assistance System sourced from Mobili, along with a driver fatigue monitoring camera, that supposedly can't record you, hands-on detection for the steering wheel a distraction-reducing head-up display projected onto the windshield ahead of the driver, and nine airbags. The optional pilot pack comes with pilot assist driver assistance that can execute lane changes in operable conditions. Along with the previously mentioned NAPA and pilot packages, there's also the Plus pack with comfort and tech upgrades, the Plus Pro pack with the electrochromic glass roof and additional interior lighting setup, or the performance pack which gets the big wheels, gold details, performance chassis tuning, and four-piston Brembo brakes. The Polestar 4 officially goes on sale in April for the US, but production has already begun. The Polestar 4 features permanent magnet, synchronous motors and dual motor and rear-wheel drive single motor variants will be on offer, featuring between 20 and 22-inch wheels. Dual motor models get a semi-active suspension setup for additional comfort or performance handling adjustment and a disconnect clutch on the front motor for improved efficiency coasting. Polestar promises up to 200 kW DC charging with vehicle-to-load bidirectional charging available. The Polestar 4 is also fast, or at least the fastest the company has accomplished so far. It sprints from 0 to 60 miles per hour in less than 3.8 seconds. Max power output is at 544 horsepower, 400 kW, and 506 lbft of torque on the long-range dual-motor car.
The long-range dual and single-motor models both come with a 102 kWh battery pack. The long-range single-motor model is good for 272 HP, 200 kW, and 253 lbft of torque, which targets a range of over 300 miles EPA but has yet to be officially determined. The single-motor model starts at $56,300 and the dual-motor model starts at $64,300. Here's a full Polestar 4 pricing breakdown. Long-range single motor is rear-wheel drive and good for 272 HP, 253 lbft, 0 to 60 miles per hour in 6.9 seconds, an estimated 300 miles of range, and starts at $56,300 including destination. Long-range single motor with pilot pack starts at $57,800, with pro pack starts at $58,300 and with plus pack it starts at $61,800. Long-range dual motor is all-wheel drive and good for 544 HP, 506 lbft, 0 to 60 miles per hour in 3.7 seconds, an estimated 270 miles of range, and starts at $64,300 including destination. Long-range dual motor with pilot and pro pack starts at $66,300, with pilot and plus pack starts at $69,800, and with pilot, plus, and performance packs it'll start at $74,300. All models get a 102 kWh battery pack and 200 kW max DC charging speed.